The journey from Yola to Basheo in Cameroon takes about five hours driving through this dusty road. The Nigeria delegation arrived at border town and are received by their Cameroonian counterparts. The COVID-19 protocol is being adhered to while accessing the venue of the meetings. Insecurity has been a major concern to border communities of Nigeria and the Republic of Cameroon as kidnappings, armed banditry, insurgency and other cross-border crimes has been on the rise. 95% of my people in Maiha and the Inverons, they sleep outside their houses for the past three, four months. It is unbearable, ransom, every day ransom, every week ransom, every month ransom. We are tired of paying ransom in Maiha. We are under siege. Total siege, 37 kidnappings in the last four months. While the representative from Basheo, the border town in Cameroon, highlights some of the decisions arrived at during the first meeting in 2020, the Adamawa State delegation reveals that an approval has been given for the creation of security camps along the border. Strengthening collaboration between the Nigerian forces and a member of the committee vigilance by means of forecast intelligence. Increase patrol of the Nigerian mountain used as enrichment for criminals like the Congoli mountain. Increase patrols along the border. The sharing of information across border for skilled operation and traditional leaders. The local government of Maya and the Cameroon border communities have a good rapport, especially in the aspect of sharing relevant information that are related to promotion of security, that the Cameroonian security agents has also handed over some Nigerian citizens who commit crime in the Cameroon Republic for appropriate disciplinary action in Nigeria and vice versa. Though the resolutions reached in this meeting is not made public, security officers from both sides of the divide are expected to meet on a later date to build on the decision of this joint security meeting.